Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're well and having a great day. As you can tell by the title of the video today, I have home bargains haul. So I went there looking for some Easter bits. My store was a bit rubbish. They really didn't have much out. They had a few Mother's Day bits, but nothing really seasonal, which I mainly go to home bargains for, but I did still get a big bag of stuff. So I thought I'd show you everything that I got. Talking of seasonal, the first thing I picked up was a box of cream eggs. You get five in here and these were $1.99. These are one of the best chocolates around. I wish they did them all year round. So we eat absolutely loads of these over Easter. So this five pack won't see us till Easter, but we thought we'd pick those up. And then I also found the pack of the mini cream eggs. So I picked those ones up and then the dairy milk little eggs. So these were about 89 or 99p each a pack. And these are to go in my girl's Easter basket. If you'd like to see um, the video of what I'm putting in the Easter basket, don't forget to subscribe and put the bell on because that'll be coming in a few weeks but that's what's going in those i then picked up a pack of the cadbury snacks these are just to fill up the snack box in the cupboard and these were 99p and then elsie chose these little chocolate lollies these are the my little pony ones they do them in paw patrol pepper pig barbie lol loads of them i think they're 79p for four she's already had one I then picked up some more Easter chocolate. These are just the little bunnies in the foil wrapper. These were 59p and I picked those up for our Easter egg hunt. They also had the little mini egg ones, but I just picked up these to be a little bit different. So like I said, I went looking for Easter stuff and there wasn't much, but I did find these in there, but I thought that Elsie would absolutely love. So they're two little colouring activity books. The first one is my spring colouring book and it was 79p. And then this is also a spring activity book but they're a little bit different and I'm sure she'll love them. She's huge into colouring and stickers and they're only 79p. So picked her up those to go in her Easter basket. I then picked her up this to go in her Easter basket and this is a surprise bath bomb in the yellow colour. They also did it in pink and it comes with a little squishy toy inside, a little rabbit chick or a little um, lamb. And I picked this up last year. She absolutely loves these and this was £1.49. Next thing I picked up was some shampoo and conditioner. This is the L'Oreal LV Full Restore 5 Repairing Shampoo. I've not tried it before. These were £1.79 each. So I thought I'd give these ones a go. The one we usually get, they didn't have. So um, yeah, picked up those and we'll see how we get on with those. I then picked up my trusty fake tan. I absolutely love this tan. If you've watched any of my hauls before, you will know I rave about this. This is the St. Moritz Original Extra Large Tan in Mousse in medium this is so cheap in home bargains it's 3.99 for the 300 ml bottle and i absolutely love it so i was nearly out so i picked up another one i then picked up some fabric conditioner i was totally out and i needed to get some more so i picked up the lenore this is also really really cheap in home bargains it was 1.99 i love getting all my um cleaning bits from there it's so much cheaper I absolutely love this. This is the Spring Awakening ones. Picked up the Febreze in the exact same scent. So this is the Lenore Spring Awakening and this was $1.99. And I absolutely love the smell of this. So I got that. Next thing I picked up was one of these Lenore Unstoppable 3 Revolution Refill. And this is in the Fresh. This is to go in a plug-in that I already have. This one was a little bit more pricey than I usually pay. This one was $3.99. I usually get a double pack in there for $4.99. But I didn't really see any fragrances I like. And I really like the smell of this one. It smells so good. It's kind of like fresh washing. And uh, that's like one of my absolute favourite smells. So I picked that one up. And I cannot wait to plug it in. I think now the weather's getting a little bit warmer. And I've been doing loads of cleaning and tidying up. And I just wanted to change up the fragrance on my plug-in. So that will make a lovely change. And yeah, like I said, cannot wait for my house to smell like this. I then just picked up a pack of 50 white envelopes. The girls always need to send letters back to school and money, and I never can find envelopes. So I picked up these and these were 89p. Then I just picked up some razors. We got the men's ones. Men's razors are so much more better than women's. Let me know if you agree, but yeah, I picked up the 10 pack of twin blade razors. And I think these ones were about a pound. So these I have seen all over Instagram and everyone has been raving about them. I'm probably going to pronounce this really wrong. So it's the hyaluronic acid. So you get seven little capsules. You do one a day and it's meant to make your skin like really hydrated. I do suffer with dry skin and I've started to get a little bit of eczema around my eye. So I thought I'll give these a go. They were $1.99 and I'm hoping they're as good as like people say they are. So yeah, I'm going to try them and I will let you all know in a future video how I got on with them and how they are. 
I then picked up a cheap little beauty blender. Mine was going a little bit grubby. And like I said, I'm suffering with some eczema around my eyes. So I wanted to change up all my makeup brushes and sponges. So I just picked up this one. And this one, I think, was either $1.99 or 99p, but no more than £2. So just got that. Like I said, I wanted to change up my makeup brushes. So I found these. I usually have the Makeup Revolution brushes. And they do sometimes stock them in um, home bargains. But they didn't have them. But they had these ones. And these are the Kate Hayes um makeup brushes you get four in there you get a contour brush foundation brush cheek brush and conceal brush then it comes with a little case and a stand and this was 4.99 so i thought i'd give those a go they seem okay they look all right um and yeah so i'm gonna see how i get on with those ones next thing i picked up was a pack of glasses these are sold individually for 59p they're just the highball tumblers or you get i think it's six for 2.99 ours always smash i don't know what it is but we're always smashing glasses in my house so i picked up another six of these and hopefully these will last this time i'll see it picked up one of these blind bags i don't know if it's my child or everyone's child but she is obsessed with blind bags anything in a bag or a ball or a box where she cannot see what it is she wants so we found this one in home bargains it's a poly pocket one it was one pound 79 so you get a little plastic uh necklace or a little um ring in the shape of something and then you get a little poly pocket that fits inside there so she got that one and then the last thing i picked up was this paint your own money box i didn't realize it was a money box so i got home i thought it was just a little figurine and this is to go in elsie's easter box um she will absolutely love this they also had it in a chick version but i just went for the bunny and you get a little set of paints and a paintbrush and these were only $1.99 they're a really decent size so I know she's gonna love painting that and then she can use it again after because it's a money box so that was everything I picked up it was a little bit of a random haul like I said I was hoping to get more easter bits I don't know if I've missed out because I've seen so many people buying so many nice things I don't know if mine just haven't got them in yet or they've sold out or what's happening but that's everything that I could find. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already because I'd love to have you on the channel. Put the bell on so you don't miss any new videos. Let me know if you'd like to see what's in our Easter basket because I'll definitely get that filmed for you. And I'll see you all in my next one.